running on um, 8.03.00200, or if you want the build, uh, 2426322, or what is commonly known as 8.03B. However, um, shortly after it was released, I think probably within a couple of days or maybe even a day, people were reporting that the vSphere web client was becoming um, not, not very responsive. Um, and um, on the 20th of September, um, Broadcom issued a, a notification that the issue is due to a change in the default behavior of recycle underscore backage within Tomcat in the release. Uh, and they have issued a uh, a workaround uh, before a permanent fix is is issued and probably dropped within this week, I would think. Um, but if you've already um, deployed and upgraded uh, to 8.03b uh, um, and it's currently in production and you don't want to roll back, um, then this is the workaround fix for you that we're going to discuss it, and it's very very quick um we haven't i haven't really seen it um in the lab yet um at least i've got this lovely green uh but you know i'm maybe not using um i'm maybe not using it enough in anger really to actually basically come across the issue yet uh, i don't know really how the issue actually manifests itself or if there's something you need to do um, um but Clearly, um, there is a workaround fix for it. So I've just actually been waiting for the backup to complete. Again, I've already created a snapshot um, of our VMware vCenter server. So in the event that I basically um, uh, mess up, I can roll back. And the other thing that I'm doing as well is I'm just actually basically backing up um, the e using Xamu as well. I've covered these in videos. I will put the description. I put the links in the description so that you can have a little look at these. So I have a snapshot. I have a backup of the vCenter server database. So um, let's move on to fixing the issue. So the first thing we need to do is basically to enable SSH on our VMware vCenter server, enable the shell, uh, and then that actually basically allows us to SSH in as root. Um, my root password is going to expire in 18 days and uh, I'm, I'm going to get that changed because um, in 18 days time when I actually basically sell in this lab again, uh, no doubt that password is going to expire. So uh, this is documented um, in the workaround fix, which I'll put in the description as well. So the first thing basically that we're told to do is um, to basically make a backup of the uh, catalina.properties file. And in fact, actually, this does uh remind me of another application that we use um which uses tomcat um and java and um we have to generally fiddle with the catalina catalina.properties file so there we go so we're going to make a backup of it and then basically it wants us to echo a variable uh to the file uh which effectively is recycle underscore package equals false um so it wants us to do that um uh, what i'm probably going to do um doesn't actually basically ask you to do this in the article but i'm just keen to see really that uh we have actually basically gone all dot apache dot catalina dot connector dot recycle underscore package equals false which is actually there now specifically in that file that we've altered and then finally all it wants us to do is restart um, the vSphere uh, UE, uh, which I'm going to do with a service to control dash restart dash dash restart vSphere dash UI. And um, it may take may take several minutes to do that in this particular environment. Um, so I'll just put this on pause and I'll come back when I've finished. And there you have it. Uh, successfully restarted service vSphere dash UI. So I can exit SSH, I can go back to and reconnect. 
did think it was actually going to basically um, just cook the throw me out. And we're logged in again now. Um, so that fix and workaround that we've applied is now been completed. So there you go. In summary, over the last three videos, we've had a look at VET uh, before upgrading our, upgrading our VMware vSphere vCenter Server 8.0a. Uh, in the second video, we used reduced downtime upgrade to uplift, upgrade, update from 8.03a to 8.03b. Uh, and of course, the bug that's been introduced into 8.03b uh, we fixed and applied uh, following this particular um, article published by Broadcom. Anyway, so as always, thank you very much for watching these videos and uh, come back soon. Bye-bye.